run, <laughs> but um, still in training because you've still got a final to compete in. Well, I have got a final to compete in. Uh, if you'd seen it last night, uh, you know that I got through the semi final and um, came second, got thrashed, but still enough to get to the final. So, weird, weird sensation. The final has actually been recorded some time ago. I'm still not allowed to say what happened, but um, I just like to run anyway. I've kind of got into a good habit, I think, so uh, trying to keep it up really. So compare and contrast the first round with the semi-final. Well, the semi-final I think was a lot more relaxed. Um, I think it was seemed to be a lot less competitive, but obviously it was, but the people didn't seem to be kind of, there was a nervous tension about the first one. We did it in front of an empty audience, i.e. an empty studio. But the second one, there was a live audience there, I think that relaxed everyone, and everyone had also done it once, so they knew, they knew what, what to expect. Yeah. You say you got thrashed? I, yeah, the guy who won, he got 38 and I got 21, which in anyone's books is a thrashing. If that was a rugby score, you'd say you'd been thrashed. But second was enough to get through, so uh, I, I just look at it as the point where it doesn't matter how you got there, as long as you got there. So, yeah. so how many in the final? Only four. So it was, there were two winners of the semi-finals and then it's ended up as being the two second places as well. And your performances, were they consistent in the first round and the semi, or did you did you? Well, no, it's funny. Um, the mental agility, which I always thought would be one of my strong rounds, I, I didn't do badly, but the other three just did better, so I came last in that. Um, the uh, observation, again, I just guessed, <laughs> and uh, I came second again, just through really not having much clue. But but pretty much by not getting a lot of wrong answers. But the third round was the one that was encouraging, the assault course, where I came uh, third last time, a lucky third, I actually came second and, and wasn't that far off the winner, so that felt good, yeah. And the general knowledge, any general knowledge, yeah. questions? No, no general, I, got, I made a bit of a boo-boo. Uh, they asked who wrote Wind in the Willows, and uh, I knew it was Kenneth, and I knew his surname was uh, another Christian name, but instead of saying Graham, I said Williams, so. Uh, that got a few giggles. Um, but the last question, I had to get the last question right, and there was two seconds left on the clock. And the last question was, in the comic book stories, who was the enemy of Ming the Merciless? So I just buzzed in very quickly and uh, said Flash Gordon, which was right. So I like to think I was saved by Flash Gordon with two seconds to go.